this is the third screening of this film. It went over like gangbusters on Friday Night at Midnight at the Ryerson. Um, and it's an, been a delight uh, to have the, uh, the director here with us. When I first met uh, Bobcat, uh, it was a number of years ago uh, when, I mean, many people don't realize that he's actually not only a, a stand up comedian, but also a director. How many people have seen Shakes the Clown? Well, after Shakes the Clown, Number number of years later, he made a little film called Sleeping Dogs Lie, and uh, I was able to introduce. Do I did one of the Q and A's for that film, and got to meet him. And uh, as I as I met him, he's like, I'm a really big fan of Degrassi Junior High. Can I go get my picture taken at the high school? <laughs> well, the problem is the high school is actually out near the airport and not near downtown. Uh, but we were able to get him to Degrassi Street and got him a picture with a sign. Um, so uh, it's actually really nice to have him back because the way that uh, this film came to us, uh, last year I screened a film with Vanguard Project called A Horrible Way to Die. And uh, he showed up to that screen. He was in town doing location scouting and he showed up to that screening and that's where I got to meet him just as an audience member. And then he emailed me earlier this year and said, uh, how can I get a film into the film festival? Well, luckily he emailed a guy who knows a guy and I was able to, uh, he sent me the film and I knew that it would work perfectly for the TIFF and Midnight Madness audience. So without any further ado, let me introduce you to the director of God Bless America, Bob Packholtway. Pretentious uh, uh, auteur mode. So I thought that'd be funny, right? <laughs> that just came out. So um, <laughs> I love that when you said maybe you saw a movie called Sleeping Dogs Lie, and one person clapped. I'm like, yeah, that's that's about the numbers it did. Um, well, it's great to stand as another movie. I made. Yes. So um, I only do movies with three word titles. I um. <laughs> Yeah, I'm like Steven Seagal. So, uh, uh, the night, I think, uh, maybe the nicest part of this uh, run of the festival is getting to know Colin. Uh, this week I got to spend a lot of time with him and his fiance Kate, and they're very wonderful people. Um, not that you're going to have that privilege, but if you, if you get a chance to, you will not be disappointed. That's very sweet. Um, I think, um, I, I'd love to tell you that I'm uh, evolved as a filmmaker and that I don't uh, ego surf and read what you say about it online, but that would be total bullshit. Um, the movie's gotten some very nice reviews. Uh, I'd have to say my favorite reviews so far have been from people who haven't seen it. <laughs> I'd like to stress this is not a political movie, but some folks in the conservative right have decided that I should be killed uh, and that I'm disgusting, like Clooney. I am Clooney, yes. It's the first time I have ever been lumped in with Clooney. Clearly, disgusting like Clooney. These people are out of their fucking minds. There's absolutely nothing disgusting about George Clooney. Um, but Jesus, wow, I'm getting thrown in with George Clooney. I never thought that would happen. Um, I, I hope you enjoy the movie. I, uh, it does mean a lot to me uh, that you're spending your Friday evening, early evening, uh, watching it. Um, I always consider when I when I'm lucky enough to get a movie in a film festival, it always feels like um, I'm one of those rich guys who pays money to play baseball with professional athletes for a week. Because as soon as this is over, I'll be back to the harsh reality of me performing in uh, Indian casinos. Uh, God, I wish I was kidding, but. Um, I am uh, one of the few uh, filmmakers uh, with a, a day job. So, um, but that's how I get to make them on my terms. So I hope you enjoy this movie. Thank you again for coming. And of course, we will be back for a Q 
Q&A. You're not going to want to miss that. Thank you to the festival's lead sponsor, Bell, our major sponsors, RBC and Blackberry, and to our major public supporters, the Government of Ontario, Telephone Canada, and of course you guys who show so much love to our directors and actors every year. Give yourselves a hand, the, Toron the City of Toronto.